G'day everybody, we're just making a short video here to uh, show off a few websites and a few tools that you can use to get free games or keys to help you uh, get more games to stream without breaking the bank. Something we get asked a lot is, uh, you know, where do we go, how do we get games from different developers or publishers um, for free to you know, help with particularly those variety streamers who can't afford to buy all the different games that they want to play for variety. So I'm going to go through a few websites and just a few tips and tricks on and how to use those websites to help you get some uh, games, basically, and uh, help with your content creation. Okay, so we're going to go through uh, one of the bigger websites that you can get uh, keys and stuff from, which is Keymailer. Uh, there's a lot of different indie games as well as some bigger games there as well. When you log in, you should log in either via Twitch or YouTube. Um, and you'll be met with this page here, which will have like what the latest news news feed is, stuff that's been promoted, the hot, hot sort of games at the moment. Um, and then you've got your coming soon, your recently released here. So um, you can also go to browse if you want to go sort of more in depth. Um, and through here, you can choose like what genre, whether or not it's a VR game, um, if it's coming soon or already released, publisher, developer, platform, um, game, etc., etc. So if we want to go for like Switch, for example, just tick that come through and then uh, these will all be switch games that you can then go for so if you go from here um, you can see from some of these games I'm already pre-approved and um, that's purely from the work that I've already done with Keymailer so I, if I want that game right now I can do it if I want Jigsaw Puzzle for Eva I don't think I do but you know it's there um, we'll use something else for an example so if we go Sunrise GP for example uh, so this says when the game's gonna be available and if we want to request a key, we can hit request here. We select what platform, um, obviously ANZ for for us, and then whether or not we're going to actually do content. Um, I don't know why you'd select to no, but you can select um, yes, definitely, or not really sure. Obviously, if you hit yes, definitely, you'll be priority over there. Um, all your details and like things like embargo and information, all that kind of stuff will be around here, including the hashtag that you need to use that tracks it through the coverage. So if we go through, we'll use an example here, we'll go to check my keys um, and we'll go through some ones that I've done recently, so like Road 96, for example. Um, so we've, we've done that, they've offered me a key for that uh, and then have a hashtag and so on. And then we go through there. No, don't, don't, worry, don't bother trying to use that key because I've already used it. So you can see from this page here that when it, once you click in it, what, this is when you successfully get given a key. Um, you'll have a page that you can promote so that tracks how many times people click that to see. Um, it's like an affiliation link, but you don't, there's no money on that unless you agree to an affiliation on it. Um, it's a hashtag, YouTube tag, Twitch category, a key mailer, a hashtag, and so on and so forth. So all the sort of stuff you need to put into your content and then it'll all get tracked through your coverage. So if we go to coverage now, you can see here, if we scroll down, you see this is road 96, so I put it in the right category, so it's got the right the right, right uh, tag put there to go through, and then it will be marked off as covered. So now if we go into, uh, I'll show you money real quick. So this is like your affiliation stuff. So if you sign up for an affiliation and people will buy the game through your link while you're streaming it, then you can get a portion of profits to it. Um, it's really for bigger sort of stuff. Okay, so now to the important stuff. Uh, I'll blur out some stuff here, don't worry about that. So this is your profile. This is where you link your YouTube, your Twitch, Facebook gaming. If you have a website, you can link it there, a TikTok, a Twitter, all goes in there. And then from here, you can go, oh, you can link your Steam as well these days. Um, it tells you that will tell them directly what games you already own and that it'll count towards your coverage as well. So if you, um, the big number here is down here you've got um, all games played slash covered VR games VR games covered and so on I've been using the website for a few years now so I've, I've played 105 games for longer than an hour and I also own 417 games that come through this website these are the sort of numbers that will help you when you're applying for other keys um, and part of that is like if you uh, if say you're want to play a game, you find the game on this website and you don't get a key, if you still use the same hashtags and the keywords and so on, it'll still count as covered and it'll go towards your stats here. So it's important to make sure that you, um, you check those stats and keep playing within that. If you go to here and hit settings on my profile, um, you've got all this information that goes through here. I won't go through absolutely everything because I don't want to dox myself, but 
For example, if I go through here, I can add all the different platforms that I have and you can link them. Um, and as well as like, uh, so like what sort of hardware you've got, so on and so forth. Um, they're all very much more and more information that you add to it. Uh, if you want to get keys, you need to make sure you go through each individual one of these and add as much information as possible. Because so many people just sign up and then start asking for keys and they wonder why they don't get any. You need to have all these fields all populated. Absolutely important. Um, but that's about it. So you basically, you, uh, you request a key and if you get given a key, it'll turn up in here. Um, sometimes they'll offer you keys just they'll just go we feel like you probably want to play this game we would like you to play it and if that's the case you can accept them or you can reject them um, you can even just say that you're too busy right now and that's basically it um, it's really good to check this sort of on a weekly basis you can also check follow them on Twitter and they'll um, announce some of their more popular ones um, but sometimes they're really basic kind of uh, shovelware games and sometimes there's some decent big ones there as well um, for example, like Dredge is obviously huge at the moment, um, and PC Game Pass is just a no-brainer. You got Farm Flipper DLC for House Flipper, Pets Hotel, um, Disney Speedstorm. That actually looks pretty dope. Uh, so the, you know you can come through here and you can go. This just came out. This gives you early access to the Disney Speedstorm Racer Unlock Additional Racer, four thousand tokens, blah blah blah. So you, you can read through it, but there's tons and tons and tons of it, and there's a lot of big publishers and stuff that work on this website as well. So definitely, definitely check them out. Next website, uh, very similar to Keymailer, um, a little less popular, but also tends to have more uh, uh, more like AAA games or, or thereabouts. Uh, you'll find a lot of, you can see here actually, a lot of Epic Games, a lot of Amazon Game Studio, Square Enix, Capcom, so on, will come through this website. So same deal as before, you can log in with your Twitch, uh, which is the easiest way. It'll actually just populate everything itself. Uh, works very similar to like a stream elements or stream, stream, whatever it is. You know, it checks, shows your followers and raids and all that kind of information. You can also lay like uh, overlays and stuff in here. Your statistics if you want. Um, but the important thing that we're here for is this here, which is key campaigns. Uh, there's not a lot on here right now, but like, uh, for example, Resident Evil 4 was on here. Final Fantasy games drop in here. Uh, anything through Square, you tend to see through here. And uh, you basically, same kind of deal. Uh, so, for example, if we come here, uh, Sniper Elite Season Pass 2, content creators, we need you. This key will grant you to all content in the Season 2 set for recent months, blah, blah, blah. So it talks about all the information here that you want to do. Um, and if you want to do it, you just hit the apply button, come up with some further information here, and then you can either agree to it. Sometimes it'll ask you a question, like, why do you want this key? Um, and you can fill that out as well. So it's worth checking out. That's the uh, rainmaker.gg. And yeah, no, no, you don't need to fill out anything, anything out afterwards. You just play the game and it'll, it'll mark it as covered or not covered as it goes through. Um, you can also go through and check your uh, campaign stuff here as well. Another website to check out. This one is Woovit. Um, I've only used this a little bit. I only, only got access to this and found out about this not that long ago. So it works very similar to the previous two. You can go into your creator access, obviously. Sign in with your Twitch. Where you go. A um, couple of cool things that this one does um, straight up. You can tick only offers that I'm eligible for, uh, which will like filter out all the ones that maybe have a higher average viewer count or you know followers and so on. Um, and you can also go through and yeah, check you know, different filters and all that sort of stuff. Um, the other thing that this one does really well, to pick a game here that sort of looks half interesting. Oh my God, there's so many. Lots of uh, kind of shovelware on this one as well. But uh, also you get things like this one, like so Sega, for example, and Atlas do a lot of their codes through this one as well. So this one does a little bit cooler sort of stuff. It'll tell you, there's, uh, so there's over 25 codes left. Um, this is for Sun Super Monkey Ball Banana Mania, um, which is, yeah, it's got all your features, all the bits and pieces that go for it, so on and so forth, um, including like a Twitter feed, which is kind of cool. There's got a contact, so if you want to talk to someone in particular, the Discord links there, and it also has here, so you must be one of the following, so you must have a minimum of a thousand followers or be a Twitch partner or, you know, 
Uh, YouTube, it just, it's just you don't meet the minimum requirements, but that's fine as well. That's all good. Um, and it says here, yeah, I got yeah, 25 codes left. Available for Steam, Xbox One, PS4, PS5, I assume as well. Um, but yeah, so that's a very cool one. Um, and you can also do the same thing. We can look at from particular suppliers and stuff like that. Um, oh, that looks cool. Some Tekken, Tekken there. Um, but yeah, so very cool. That's so that's woovit.com. Um, I haven't actually done anything through there yet, but uh, very similar sort of play. Like you, you link it through your uh, Twitch, so it knows when you've played the game and when you've covered it and so on. That's kind of cool. What is that? That's cool. Um, but yeah, very cool if you want to uh, work closer with like suppliers and, and brands because you've got straight up a contact there that you can contact and talk to them about the games and so on. Um, but yeah, all right, next one. So the next website we're going to go and check out is one called Lurkit. So lurkit.com. Um, you log in as a creator as you normally would. You'll find that there's lots of different keys and lots of different sort of deals and stuff that go on here. We go to keys in particular. Um, heaps of different keys that you'll find on here, like just loads for all different platforms, PC, PS5, X, bloody Xbox, you name it, they're on here. Same sort of deal you can do, um, search by a tag, search by a platform, so on and so forth. The only sort of difference between this and say the other websites that we've looked at previously is that let's go for, for example, Potion Permit, great game, by the way. Um, so if we went to do this one, for example, um, so they've got your platforms here, you've got your requirements, so 500 average views per video on YouTube, which I have apparently. Um, all these just sort of information about the game, all that kind of stuff. So if you request a key and you're successful and they send you a key, um, the difference on this one is that you need to uh, submit your coverage afterwards. So it's like a manual process. Um, so just use an example of one that I think we picked up. So here, um, you'd have to go in here, you go, you get a campaign kit, which gives you all that information, similar to what you see on the key mailer, but then you come here and go submit content. Um, and then you would uh, submit your content to mark it as covered, basically. Um, so you can see here, you just basically select which one it is and then away you go. Which it's not, it's not, that, not that, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna break that. Okay, let's, let's go. Break that there. Okay, but otherwise, just a, as another, another um, really good website for finding lots of lots of keys. This one here is Terminals IO. Security check. Log it in. Log it in. Log it in. Here we go. Um, so very similar to the, the last one that we looked at, the, uh, the Lurkit kind of one. So you can go through here, um, submit request if you want to play particular games. And then once you get a given a game, um, you just cover it. And I think on this one, you do need to submit coverage as well. But like I said, I haven't used this one as much. Um, but they do have a lot of different uh, codes and games that you maybe won't find on the other websites, which is quite good as well. Um, so this one here is just another another one to check out every now and then. This is terminals.io. Okay, so this one here is a new one. Someone showed me just recently. Um, a little bit different, but also another great way to get a lot of games and keys. So this one here is daredrop, daredrop.com. Um, but basically, it's not necessarily just requesting keys for particular games, but they'll issue challenges to go through with those games. Um, so if we, for example, let's go to, let's look at Filthy Animals, the High Simulator by Green Man Gaming. So right up here, you have that uh, 57 keys are available for this one. Uh, so you can join this drop and get a Filthy Animals High Simulator Steam key when completing a dare. So you can get that. And then uh, basically you have dares. And depending on which dare you do, you can get things for it. So um, stuff the elevator, take all the objects from the level and ran <laughs> into the elevator. will give you a loot for fans of an avatar pack. So um, I'm not 100% sure on, like I haven't explored this completely because some, some of them tend to give like uh, skins and, and giveaways and stuff like that that you can give to uh, your viewers. 
and then other ones like will give away actual games like other games to people so um, for example which one was I looking at before I think we were looking at oh my god is there a Renfield game is there a Renfield game I didn't know there was a Renfield game that's weird um, so yeah you can go through here for example so these give you Escape Academy Steam Key. Uh, Escape Academy Steam Key for viewers. Uh, Rainbow Billy, The Curse of the Leviathan Steam Key for viewers. So you could basically just collect Steam Keys. Um, this, so it's, yeah, This is new. This is new to me as well. But I just thought I should bring this up because I, I haven't seen a lot of people talk about this. Maybe one or two people before. Um, but it's yeah, it issues you actual challenges to do, which is kind of cool. Okay, so I'll chuck in all the links for the websites in the description below. I hope this has been relatively helpful in helping you find uh, more keys to help you, you know, spend less money but play more games and, uh, yeah, help with your content creation journey. If there's more websites that you know of or want to suggest anything else, uh, chuck them in the comments below and I'll be sure to, uh, if we get enough, I'll make a follow-up video and share them along because... Uh, yeah, this, this sort of stuff is very, very helpful, particularly to uh, streamers on a budget. So um, I hope it's been yeah, helpful to you.